Hello my friends, welcome back to the Manitarium. Today I'm going to, on this Suburban, I'm going to tackle this drawer that I'll be putting under here. That way I can um, get ready to finish all this out some more. And this seems to be the next thing that I want to do. I can have a drawer that pulls out here that I'll be able to keep jack storage and whatever I need to put in there. So let me get with it, see what I can come up with. This is all kind of flying out the see in my pants because there's no way to actually you know measure it and do it you just kind of got to grab stuff and start making it so we'll be right with you after this Hopefully the wind ain't too bad out here, but a friend of mine gave me this um, Coolit brand acoustical mat, and it also has a little bit of insulating value. I probably should have put it in first, but I didn't exactly know how I'm going to do it. So this spot here is all going to get that acoustically mat, mat underneath it to um, keep the sounds down a little bit and maybe insulate the, a little bit there. And um, let's, I'll see if I can get that in here. It's self-adhesive on one side like a big tape and then you put it down and you just kind of try to mold it against everything and this stuff is older so I don't know how well it's going to work for me. You know it's been sitting around for a few years and um, we'll see what I can do with it. Well that stuff all stuck down there pretty nice and um, that should give me some rattle help with any rattles from this wood I'm going to be putting in here. I made this um, kind of a box that'll be going in there that'll attach to the bed and be um, pr propped up from underneath and um, then it'll have the, the box will have the drawer in it. So let me slide this in here and then I'll kind of show you where I'm going with that. Okay, I'm starting to get the base of this drawer in there. It's all leveled out with the acoustical mat underneath it. This is going to extend the bed out this way when I get done and the drawer will be underneath it. Now I'm going to um, make a, a face for this board. And um, yeah, we'll go from there. Be back in a moment. Okay, I took me a piece of cardboard and made a template. What I wanted to do here. And then I um, went backwards and um, did that like that. So I knew what the board was gonna do. And then I took my jigsaw and my sander. And now I've got this down to there. So then now what I will do is I will go in and I will, on the back side here, I will um, mark this so I can cut it out where that drawer is actually going to be and then this will be finished off on the outside edge and then the drawer will slide into there. So I'll be right back with you in a little bit when I get further. Okay, we got the box all done, ready for the drawer to be built tomorrow. And then I'm going to build me a secret cubby hole back here. Don't tell anybody about that. I don't want them getting into my good stuff back there, but this is all a lot solider. Then um, I might take a few days off, but I might also start on that side over there next. And with that, then um, I can build my bed platform. And the reason I'm doing this first instead of the ceiling is because that way I can lay on my back and do the ceiling. Because I'm a big guy and being on my hands and knees is kind of sucky. But So one thing at a time. So if you like this content, don't forget to um, subscribe, share, and... Um, like it push the little notification bell and um yeah if you got any comments don't be afraid you know i'm just kind of a one of the people that gets it done i'm not a craftsman i just kind of get it done anyway but so if you like this stuff don't be afraid to say something so thanks we'll see you in the next one